Hi, everybody. How have you been doing lately? Today is the Friday, the June 28th. So earlier this morning, I have my blood transfusion. Together with it was my once every three to four months now doctor consultation. During then, the doctor reviewed my latest MRI T2 star result. So if you did check out my previous the update video, I share about my latest ferritin level, which was then 2200, which was reduced uh, from the 2500. Not only it has been reduced, but together with it, it dragged down my latest liver iron level in the MRI, this uh, result. So I show you the MRI form itself. So this is how it looks like, the review results. Are the doctor give me a copy always uh, on top is my name the date of scan date of birth a consultation name and my doctor yeah dr ang eileen the al is the short form hospital sgh singapore general hospital ward outpatient is the scanner i think the machine the mri machine this uh air va 2 1.5 t uh, my heart rate uh, bsa lv mass this one BP level that, which was those blood pressure. Here the cardio vesicle, metallic, metatit. These are MRI, the short form imaging, and my indications: beta thalassemia major and all that normal that you don't normally read. Just see it's normal can already. So here is the result that we normally care about. So let's take a look at the uh, the heart T2 star first, uh, which was also a very important point, but not that important to me as my result uh, is particularly good in the heart as well as it was on years on L1. So let's take a look on the latest one, which was uh, the June 11, I have my scan. The latest result for the heart T2 star is 37.4 ms which 37.4 is non-hard iron overload as you can see the anything more than 20 ms is non-hard iron overload so my is 37.4 is far out of the question even my previous one the last year july 24th is also 36.7 uh, my best result is on the two, year 2007 which was 43.6 uh, double the range where i don't do not have the hard iron overload at all non so the liver t2 star that what we are concerned because the reason why i was switched to sj was my this uh, liver iron has uh, tremendously increased due to the uh, l1 culators itself is not capable of uh, reducing both in the heart and the liver is uh, targeting best in the heart uh, but not so much on the liver so as a uh, it's not so much in the liver, it uh, increased my liver iron overload over time uh, due to my transfusion, having the iron overload all around my body, including my liver. The range is not uh, tremendously reduced. So the uh, the last year, let's take a look, it's uh, July 24th is 0 0.8 ms, which the range is for liver iron overload is bad. Anything below 1.4 ms is severe. So this year I have 9, so 0 0.9 I think, the uh, 1.5 ms, so 1.4 is just uh, get into the moderate range. But the uh, doctor say uh, you don't look at the liver T2 star, what, what you really want to look is this, uh, they call it the liver iron concentration, which was closer to the accurate, the most accurate uh, result uh, in the MRI. Because uh, MRI is not like other scanning, which uh, like ferro scan, they have like better scanning result. This is the closest uh, after calculation. You have to time two the result. So mine is about nine on the latest one. We your time two is about one point eight. So it's still within the uh, normal range, moderate range. It's not normal though, but it's st still far way to go. I uh, hope to get to the mid or non over time though. So, but anyway, it's uh, still good. Uh, the conclusion, uh, they say normal LV, L is the left and RV is the right size. Uh, norm, no hard iron loading, moderate liver iron loading. So this uh, date of scan is on the uh, June 11. 
which just to update you guys so my I do not have uh, any hard iron overload as I'm on L1 for many years and the SG itself is still capable of getting rid of now in the liver and heart so my heart uh, is predict won't be increased the level and my liver will will be expected to be slightly reduced over time the liver iron in it so there's some patient uh i'm not sure what what was your latest mri a t2 star result of fair scan care to share with me how's your result compared to me is it uh, much better or much worse do share with me so thanks for watching hope you have a nice weekend